Well, a very good evening to you as you join us for tonight's live game. Unfortunately, our weather forecast is somewhat less than promising. We're told to expect intermittent spells of heavy rain, which might very well impact on the quality of the football later. It'll certainly add a new dimension, especially for those players who like to keep hold of the ball. A few anxious faces, hoping it will all somehow stay away. But I have to tell you that, we are told, is an extremely unlikely scenario. This one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it, and indeed to one of the grandest pitches. The information we've been given is that they're going to go with a 3-5-2. It's a setup that's been enjoying quite a renaissance in recent times, and one that complements the counter-attack very nicely, with two strikers, two wing-backs, and potentially two runners from central midfield you can understand its attraction because it really can get the numbers into the opposition's box and equally it can get the numbers back into your own and we're underway doesn't get the pass he's looking for well he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there uh, Peter, his body shape was a giveaway before he made the pass, and its obviousness was, was appreciated. Balls out on the left now. A mixture of good defending and indecisive passing. No progress. Hoists it forward. And they're not going to make any further progress now. Tries to get it forward quickly. It's anyone's ball. The fact that we haven't had an attempt on goal is becoming a, an embarrassing reflection on these teams. Forward it goes. Cuts it out. He's got options out wide. Is it out of harm's way? Has a pop! Try. The outcome could so easily have been different. Well, I suppose it wasn't the worst attempt if you consider how far out he was. Well, that's where he wants it. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Tries to locate someone up front. And that is as far as they got a real chance! They've scored! And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. <laughs>
Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. Tried to play it through. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run. He just didn't get enough behind it. It happens. Rain starting to fall here. It has been looking that way for a little while. And it's played forward. Just brushed off the ball there. Tries to get it forward quickly. He's in space and looking for options. And a header! Oh, he couldn't get the direction he needed. Ah, oh, this was all about good movement in the box just to allow him to get to it. And it's played forward. He's made sure that that won't get through. And the half-time whistle goes. So there you have it, a close sport half of football. But Rodgers still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. Not the most convincing of displays. They could certainly do much better than this. They'll want to keep things simple, build up their confidence, and not rush into mistakes. Already up and running for the second half. Well, I'm sure the managers talk the talk, and now it's time for these players to walk the walk and deliver a rousing response to a rousing team talk. Played into space out wide. Oh, that is lovely footwork. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Driving on now, what can they conjure from here? And he nearly went all the way. I just hope he won't let the failure to score affect him. With the ability he has, he can reproduce. It's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. Chasing the game, trailing by one. Forward it goes. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. so far Jim well they may be down but they're far from out in terms of chances they're right up there with these opponents oh, well intercepted really alert to the danger That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Out towards the flank, goes for the cross. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. And Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do.
keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Done very well to intervene. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Hoists it forward. It is looking like the end. If anything's going to happen, it's got to happen now. They need something heroic now, or a lucky break, or a kind refereeing decision. Anything. He's a clever pass. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. They seem to have lost their sense of direction. Uh, it should be higher up the pitch. So that's it. It is all over. So it ends 1-0. An enthralling game and an agonisingly narrow defeat. Your reflections then, Jim. It's just a bad day at the office, Peter. They look below par in all areas, and it has to be cause for genuine worry. Well, that's it for tonight's match. So it just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin alongside me and to wish you all a very good evening.